my four iron, which is, you know, it's not blade, it's an MP20, but it's not too chunky. And then you have this Strix one, which is designed, it's, it's more of a driving iron. Uh, this one I'd say is more of a finesse iron. And you can see the difference. I mean, it's pretty mad, the difference in the, in the width at the bottom there. Yes, down at the bottom here. Yeah, um, yeah. So, you know, I like my forearm. I like I can control it. Will I sacrifice control over distance? Should we find out? Let's do it. Okay, so we're back. So I'm going to hit my four iron first. Um, what do I hit this, Gareth? It's what is cold today? Probably the 190, 200 yards. Yeah. Um, so let's hit a few. Let's see what I'm kind of kind of numbers I'm getting. Um, I'm going to try and hit it the fair every time, so it's a bit more of an accuracy test as well. Yeah. Uh, and just see what numbers I'm getting, and we can change it over and see there's a vast difference. Do you, before you start, Derek, um, see your hat. Yeah. It looks very like a subscribe button. Doesn't yeah. it? Is that why you wear that? I think so. It's like a subconscious thing. When people watch our videos, well, they, they don't. Just, uh, they don't. They, they clearly don't. <laughs> yeah, no, it's annoying. So you've got to click what? <coughs> subscribe button. Yeah. Why is that? Because then we have more people like subscribe to us. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Because we do all right stuff. You know, it's not. It's not. Not terrible. And um, <laughs> you know, <laughs> way to go. Yeah. <laughs> We're, we're, we're not golf IQ, we're not terrible. <laughs> That's the most important thing. Right, um, four iron, let's go. Let's go four iron, yeah. Enough small talk. Sounded good. I think it's good. It's a 189 carry and a 197 total. That's about right, I'd say, for me, yeah. Is yeah. it a fair way? Is it slightly right, right side. It's got to work out where I've got to hit the net, that's all. Was that a shank? Oh, that was a half a shank. Yeah, oh, it definitely was. That went over right ankles. <laughs> <sighs> no wonder no one wants to subscribe. Who <laughs> <laughs> wants, wants to see a middle-aged, overweight man shanking it the whole time? <laughs> middle-aged? <laughs> 33. You seem as me. Yeah, well. I'm still young. Okay, let's try not to shank it. Let's try and hit yeah. actual got decent it. shots like for this one. exercise. There we go. There right. we go. Let's straight on the middle. 201. Lovely. Look at that. Straight as an arrow. Oh, that's beautiful. Sight to behold, Gareth. One ninety two. That's all right. One more? Yeah. Uh, leaked out to well. the right slightly, I'd say, but it's, just, it's well okay. Well struck. It's okay. Right. Okay, so we're back with the Strix on. Um, what is it? A ZX? Isn't it's it? a ZX driving iron. It's, it's 23 loft. degrees. 23. It's um, quite cool with the lofts on it, isn't it? Yeah, I like. I just like Strix like on. That? I think they're cool. Yeah. It's a good brand. Um, fully forged, and it's a hollowed out head for maximum ball speed. Is that what that little dot is here, where they, where they fill? Potentially, yeah. Yeah, yeah. But um, I like the look of it. Um, the one thing I don't massively like about it is how thick the top line is. Um, that is super, super heavy. But I like the fact that it's a squat design. It's not too long in blade length. Um, and it's graphite shaft, so I should be swinging it slightly faster. I think I was averaging around 95 in the last set I was doing. Um, but I'm, I'd hope to see a bit more distance. Now, I don't really hit four iron to finish today. I rarely hit a four iron. Because I'm such a long hitter, I usually have a wedge in. Um, but <laughs> <laughs> Please don't, don't think I'm serious. Uh, do you know what though? He is actually being serious. <laughs> That's the worst bit. Uh, no, uh, I don't know. I, you yeah, do I hit just, four irons, yes. I do hit four irons. But I, I'd rather hit a three iron, well, what if it's a a three iron runner or like a hard five iron. I rarely hit a four iron spinner to do. Anyway, we're hitting this one. <laughs> we're just going to see what difference there is. Yeah, that's all we're here for, mate. <laughs> that was so badly hit. Yes. Horrible. I agree. Fat. I agree. That was a fat shot. 169. But do you know what? It's down the middle. It's done okay. 
It's slightly longer in length than the last time we did the three iron against three iron. It's a little bit longer in length. Oh, that was struck. We there we go. <coughs> 193. Okay. 199. Not crazy, is it? Nope. But that we're was gonna, well too. We're going to obviously look at launches and spins and, and yeah. see if there's any difference there. Yeah, 189. Wow. Two more should do it. Yeah, two more should do it. So mm, thicker, be okay. thicker top line. Yeah. Thicker top line. It's a feel lighter. It's that. It's got a clickier sound. Okay. And that's because it's hollowed uh, rather than yep. a full uh, full face like the my one I have. Does it feel lighter? Uh, not massively. What about when you're swinging it? No, I no. wouldn't say so. It kind of feels quite similar, actually. Okay. Um, I'm not actually swinging it particularly faster as well. It's very, very mm. similar to what I'm doing with my own club. Oops. That was a nice strike, so that should be out there. Oops. A little out to the right. That was struck okay. Right. What do you think the difference will be, if any? If I was to hold those two clubs up, I yep. would think this would go at least 10 yards further. Really? Because it's got a graphite shaft, because it's hollowed out, and it's designed for ball speed. Okay. Mine isn't at all. My club is a forge, it's more for spin and accuracy. Do you think um, with it being a hollow design, it gives you any more forgiveness of off-center hits? Potentially. I mean, yeah, there was a couple there where it weren't, weren't my best, but they were actually okay. So maybe more forgiving. So um, over the space of a year, compared to your own forearm, the odd miss hit might be you know, yeah. perform a bit better. Right side of green rather than right rough kind of thing. Um, yeah, potentially. All right, talk us through the numbers, Gareth. What have we got? Right, so we have in the in the pink here, we have the your own four iron. And it's carrying at 192.4. Which I'd expect at this time of year. And the Shrix one is 192.9. Okay, so let's say 0.5 a yard difference, probably <laughs> negligible. Same, yeah. Total distance, 201 with yours, 198 with, with the Shrix on. Okay, negligible. Club head speed was within one mile an hour. Yeah, swinging slightly faster, which I get, because it's, it's obviously it's, it's, um, it's not steel. It's the Shrix on was spinning at 400, just under 400 revs more. Yeah. Launching um, just over, what's it, 1.4 degrees higher. Yeah. Um, the smash factor was the same. So your strikes were, were sort of equivalent. Yeah. And um, at the end, you've got your ball speed was, was that 2.4 miles an hour faster? Yeah. So I guess if, if you think about it, I mean, when you said it was more forgiving, I guess it is. It's slightly higher spinning. I'm, get, I'm getting a faster um, swing speed through it because of the graphite. Yes. Um, but it's, and it's launching higher. So I guess it, in terms of forgiveness, it probably is a bit more forgiving club than my club. Yeah. Um, the thing is, I do miss hit, but I'm not. A, I don't massively miss hit, um, so I probably wouldn't change personally. But it's a nice club, and uh, it's it's you know, I had a few miss hits there, which would have been a lot worse with my MP20 than that Strix on. Mm -hmm. um, so yeah, I mean, it's 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 a nice. It's definitely a nice club for the. I wouldn't you know, not someone who flushes it every time. Not saying that I do, but. You know, I think it's it's aimed at a certain type of golfer. Here's I've just added in two more figures, right? Yeah. Here's where it might change your mind a little bit. Okay. okay. I, it probably wouldn't, but it's it's this might sway you more. Okay. If we look at those two figures at the end, this is the height in feet. Yeah. Your one was flying 104, is is the highest part, and the Shrek's one was 119. Yeah. It's going 15 feet higher. Yeah. So it's 15 feet higher with slightly more spin, and the land angle was steeper at 51 it's degrees. It's gonna stop up quicker for sure. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So four iron, four iron is tough to do that with. So that extra yeah. bit of height gives you the, the steeper land angle with more spin. Yeah, 100%. So depending on where you play, you know, yeah. if you're a legs player or dry, dry, you know, in Australia where you like to be right now, yeah. um, you know, 
that extra height and land angle with the spin is, is going to help. That's it, for sure. But I feel like I could probably flight my forearm if I was trying to. This was just hitting the ball, you know? You could hit it higher if you wanted to. Yeah, I could flight it up higher. Yeah. Um, but as I was saying, you know, this would, this would be a superb club for a certain <coughs> type of player who but, may not be as confident with the long irons, but, but love to hit them. What I mean is, as, as standard shots go, the yeah. Strixon is going higher. Yeah. Without you trying to hit it. Oh, higher. yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. when you start to hit the Strix on higher, then you're going to always have that advantage over of your course. own Of course, no, absolutely. Yeah. But the thing is, living in Northern Ireland, you want quite a low ball flyer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Um, and, and, and listen, your, your forearm is spinning at 5,000, which is healthy. Yeah. So it's yeah. not like it's really low spin. Mm -hmm. um, so it's what I expected a little bit more launch, <clears throat> a bit more height, a bit more spin. Um, similar numbers and, and, and similar carry distance is really similar yeah uh, but certainly I, I think over the over the space of a year if you're looking to I think the average golfer in my opinion should certainly maybe certainly maybe that's, 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 that doesn't make sense <laughs> but should look at a hybrid as opposed to a four iron oh for sure yeah you know yeah. even possibly down to a five hybrid yeah um, but for somebody that's you know hits it as far as you do you know drive a wedge yeah you never really use a four iron anyway so. <laughs> it's true cheers thanks